So Maybe. I'm going to try to drive as close as I can. Oh, wow. There's nothing happening. It's no, not that bad. Very easy to take. So. Some information here. Wow. Well, it's it's something like, uh, yeah, something you can, I don't know, it's, it's a pro pro provincial park. Provincial yeah, a park, park it's or a something park. like that. You can do lots of walks here and visit the place and there's lakes and everything. But we are coming from the uh, monument, you know. There's a crater also. The war monument. The yep. monuments. Yeah. We are going for the war monument. Yeah. I wish I had to come off. Hi. Where are we? Uh, we are at Palingbeek. Palingbeek, yes. There's um, some artwork here for uh, the lost soldiers in World War One in Palembic, and we're gonna have a look at the, the artwork. It's rather large, so uh, I hope you like this video, guys. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna run into the sun because you guys can't see my face. I uh, hope you will subscribe to my channel because uh, we need the support for you from you, of course, and it's free. So. Press that like button, comment, and subscribe. See you in the place. We have Lily with us, Martin, and this is the forest. It's a forest area, and there's a lake here. But most of all, the artwork is uh, great to see, so we're gonna walk up there. It's not that far. And I hope I can make some drone shots of it also today. I think it's yeah, it will be possible. It's not that far. You can see it between the trees down there. So uh, yeah, let's go there. See you at the place. That made this piece of art down there. I'm gonna have a look closer. And um, it's a Belgian artist, Koen van Mechelen. 
and uh, he made this with 600,000 little statues and um, yeah every 600,000 statue has a name and they um, yeah uh, point out to the first world war victims that were died on Belgium ground so uh, let's have a look to the place Martina how yeah. do you like this at the moment? Uh, very nice. It's nice. Very nice. The place is very nice also, people. So uh, let's have a look closer. So here we are, people. This is the artwork. The little 600,000 statues are in there. All people kneeling down with their heads to the ground. And uh, yeah, they represent every soldier that died here in the First World War, the Great War. And actually, uh, it's a little deeper in the ground, you can see, that represents a crater. So, that's what they represent with the hole in the ground. It's a uh, sort of, yeah, explosion and then the artwork is made in there. Let's have a walk around it. It's very nice maintained. The grass is short. It's, uh, yeah, I think they have a lot of work clean, uh, keeping it clean here. You cannot trespass the arch, so you cannot go over the rope. To get a closer look, it's normal because you can damage the art and it represents something special. So, yeah, and uh, we have a little look. <laughs> Somebody very naughty is coming up. Yeah, <laughs> our lazy old dog. Yeah. <laughs> 16 year old dog. As I said before, she can't walk that far anymore. And it's not far actually to the car, but the dog is really old. <laughs> and because it's very hot, yeah, we, uh, we keep her in the buggy. So I think this is what you can expect from this place if you ever visit it. It's uh, quite serene and there's a lot of places you can walk here and through the forest and everything but I'm not gonna do that people because uh, yeah, I'm not able to so and my dog is not able to <laughs> no, uh, maybe my wife can have a look if there's something more to see and then she comes back and tell me if it's far or not far and then we see what happens So uh, this is the artwork, I hope you liked it. There will be some drone shots coming up. So uh, let's check that out and see you.
It's neither two more yours. Um, yeah, it's great to see. Yeah. Love it. There's also actually a little crater here. That's from an uh, explosion in the First World War. And uh, it's a hole in the ground. Filled with water now. Uh, yeah. People keep it like that. They use the holes for water pits or whatever. Um, and it's a crater. There's a lot of those small craters in uh, Flanders fields. Uh, some of them are made by men, but this is one of uh, an explosion. They also all registered in the database, which one are from explosions and uh, have been kept like that to remember. So, a little information sideways. <laughs> <laughs> hello, hello, people. Here we are again. Well, you have seen a uh, yeah, uh, new uh, video. Um, it's very nice down there. It's a park where you can walk a lot. My wife did the walking. You have seen yeah. that. <laughs> After two hours, I, I was back in the, uh, yeah. in the camper. Yeah. So <laughs> she did uh, more than 20 kilometers. So, yeah, 27. Uh, I stayed in the camper. I was a smart one, but I can't walk that far. So, so yeah. Um, and yeah, we're we're gonna close the video here. I hope you can subscribe our channel. Yep. Yes, it's for please. free. It's for free. And uh, yeah, well, enjoy your day. And peace out. You.